hello and welcome back to Buckland Junction. It's out. No, I'm not in the loft. I'm in the hobby room again. Now, uh, while I was doing my live, um, I started on a low relief building uh, that I want to end the town. Now, I'm going to make it on this 9mm piece of cut-off um, ply. So that's it. I've already made a start. Uh, during the live I had a bash and while I was live somebody says I, I was going to call this a warehouse Reynolds storage or, and removals or something but uh, while I was on um, doing my live one of, the, one of the people that was watching in forget, forgive me I've forgotten their name uh, said why don't you make it Reynolds Bury and I thought oh, what a perfect decision it's amazing what you get off other people so there's my um, retaining walls so to speak and my brewery goes in here now this is the um, this is the uh, top mount the uh, where the signage is going to go so there we have the kind of outline of the building so it's going to be Reynolds Ales uh, and just put the uh, whatever it is brewery there dove down brewery yeah something like that I haven't quite decided but thanks whoever gave me the idea to go for the brewery so that's the uh, that's the basics and now I'm going to make the um, detail of the building inside to fit inside so let's put that out of way out of the way for now this is as far as I've managed to get during the live. I've got um, um, the front door in uh, in blue, just literally drawn with uh, a pencil and then coloured in with watercolour. Now I'm going to carry on and you'll see that uh, uh, this is how the um, this is how it should look kind of thing with the uh, name board up there. So I've got to paint in some windows probably four pane sash windows and same but slightly bigger one for the office window um, I might even get a door in here I'm not sure whether that will work or not probably not now but never mind um, right, let's get on with that a bit more timber work I have some supports to each level and I've added my window frames this one's a bit mm, winky wanky because it's not in the center but never mind onwards we go moving on forward uh, just added a bit of brick just thought it needed it to start it off now I've got the laborious part of putting all the boards the ship lap in all the way up to the top now before I paint anything so let me get that boring bit done this is good timing <clears throat> one two three careful not to draw across any windows or anything hopefully this shows up um, I've put all my plank in now it's taken me ages kind of I've gone over a couple of places where I shouldn't have done but now I'm going to put in the uh, the oak beams that are going to be black put them in now a brownie black now as I said I don't really want a black and I don't want brown so I'm going to mix the two I've got ivory black Noir d'Ivoire and we've got Burnt Umber, Terre, Dombre, Brulee. So we've got that and we'll mix them up out of the way of this because I, you know, I don't want to get any splashes on here. Here's it, 
dark enough. Yeah, I think so. Let's give that a while. I've also put one spot of PVA in it just to give it a little bit of viscose. So let's try that. <clears throat> Starting to wish I'd use watercolour paper now because cartridge paper is not the best paper for watercolour because it buckles and puddles in the in the thing. But we'll see how that turns out. There we go, that's dry. Let's get rid of this paint and we're gonna go for some windows. Using a bit of Payne's grey, I think, for the windows. Yeah. Okay, ready to go on further. We've got four, eight. 12, 16, 20 windows to do now. Can we use Payne's Grey and a bit more, um, a bit more of PBA. So it's got a bit of a shishy shi shi shine to it. Oh, what? Oh. Ah. Yeah, I want a bit of bit of PVA in there and a bit of water too. Not enough to do 20 windows. Right, let me mix this up. Test the first. Is that what I want? Yeah, I think that's all right. I think that's fine. I think that's good enough for me. Uh, let's put it together now and then I'll go down and design the signs. A Reynolds, I think Dove Down Bury, Fine Ales and Stouts, something like that. Right, let's cut her out first. Welcome back to Buckland Junction, it's Britannia again for the second week running. Look at it go! No, not stopping. You have to be careful with work, work, working with um, watercolored card and and um, and glue. Um, normally, I just whack this on with a paintbrush, but uh, to get a more uniform coat, I'm using a sponge, and then I can <clears throat> I can then lay this on. Without too much worry that it's going to buckle up and go waffy, but you don't get much slippage if at all. <clears throat> There's very little glue, but it's um, it's nicely spread, so you don't get any warps and buckle. There we go. We got our um. And brick abutments there and now the top sign or the top of the building there so next comes a bit of photoshop in for a a reynolds dove down bury 
fine ales and stouts. I think that will do it. I've got some barrels that I can put outside as well. So, Photoshop next. Blending options, stroke, black, okay, one, <clears throat> that do, whoops, fine nails and stouts, bring her down a bit, and see if this seagull will come across now, uh -huh, come on seagull, Oh, come on. Oh, okay. Oh, where's the seagull gone? Never mind, you get the idea. Lovely coaches as well. Okay, there we have it. Um, Reynolds Brewery, fine ales and stouts. So let's go and put her in place. I'm not sure if it's going to stand up on its own, but we will work that out when we get there. Train spotting on the bridge again. Well, welcome back to the Lost. Can't run any trains at the moment because it's it's about half past ten, quarter to eleven. So uh, that's where I want the brewery to go to end the scenery. So let's get it in place. I've aldited a goodly mag magnet on the back. Um, I can never remember what these magnets are called, but they're ready and available on eBay. So let me put her in position. We'll find a place for the camera first. Here we go. <clears throat> well, this isn't stock yet. This is just a, a piece of Pico um, background that I'm going to stick in at some point. <laughs> Let me just get my brewery in place. So it really does kind of end, end the uh, town scenery. There we have it. Well, still work to do here. Looks like there's been an earthquake by the looks of that. <laughs> but anyway, so uh, town scene coming along nicely. I will stick these in position, these uh, bits. And there's the uh, brewery right at the end. So I just need a, um, a dray, is it? A brewer's dray wagon outside. I've got some barrels. So that's it really, sorry can't run any trains, but uh, yeah, this end of the layout has come on a million dollars, so all I can say is, Alan out, the brewery, Reynolds Brewery is in place, take care good people, Alan out. Mm -hmm.